Hey y'all, so I'm just in my home studio and I wanna let y'all in on a little secret. So three years ago when I started painting, I was just painting in my dorm bedroom, you know? Um, I graduated last year, now I'm just painting in my mom's living room. She moved out her dining table for me. And now I'm really excited to let y'all know that this Sunday I'm moving into my own studio space I'm upgrading y'all. It's about to be lit. I'm so excited. This is just to give y'all some perspective right here. This is my studio. All my art stuff is right here. So I'm packing up all this stuff. I'm bringing all these lights. I'm bringing everything. So new levels, new level. So I just finished putting the finishing touches on this Haiti painting that was actually a commission. So that's done. And now I gotta pack all my stuff. So it's literally like 10.53 p.m. right now. And I have to pack everything by tomorrow. So I'm definitely gonna be up late, but it's okay. I'm excited to get out of here and into my new studio, so. What's up, y'all? It's Sunday. It's moving day. I'm at my friend Mary's house right now. We crashed here for the night. We're about to get going to get the U-Haul truck, but real quick, I wanted to show y'all something in Mary's house real quick. So I started painting like three years ago, and Mary, one of my best friends, actually gave me like my first commission job ever, and it was a portrait of her parents for their anniversary, and... I painted this huge like portrait of them and like this is way in the early days y'all so it's hanging right right here I'm gonna show y'all real quick take a look at this look at that so yeah guys that's early days and Faulkner you can see the huge difference from then until now in my work you know you know back then my lines weren't that straight you know the paint coverage was a little bit sloppy you know but I was still learning back then really and everyone always asks me you know what's the key to getting better the key is practice practice every day and you'll be sure to improve this this is a testament right here for sure but i'm still proud of it though you know all right so we're low-key running late but it's okay we gotta go get the u-haul truck right now bye thanks for letting us crash no <laughs> later There's our U-Haul. All right, so this is all the stuff we're moving. Got everything packed up already. Basically, we can stack these boxes on the thing, I guess, and then just push it. And then, this is what I was more worried about with the dolly. I don't know. You want to do that first? Sure. This is
tired? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a little bit hot. Thanks for helping me deal. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, so we just made it to the studio. Ah! <laughs> About to unload. Woo. Okay, let's do this. All right, y'all, here's my studio. This space right in here. This is it. We'll start unloading stuff. We're done moving. Take a look. All my stuff is in here. Ooh. So, so I'm not gonna unpack today because that's just too much in one day. So today we just moved everything and I'm gonna leave them here um, overnight and then come back during the week and then unpack and put everything in this place and after that i'll show you guys around properly but for now here's like a mini tour so when you enter this is like the common area and then over here is my space and basically i brought some canvas prints my shelf where i put all my art supplies some drop sheets paint drake all these boxes are just art supplies, glassine paper, mini ladder, huge roll of bubble wrap, easel, easel, some boxes, a shelf to hold my supplies, and a couple paintings in here, and some canvas and more art supplies and stuff in here. So we're leaving this, we're leaving all this stuff here for now, but we're gonna come back. For it later so yeah this is my studio space right now y'all it's got pretty decent sized ceilings and basically down there are where a whole bunch of other artists are working so this right here is like storage and then over here is like this is the art sink and then like the kitchen area fridge and then there's a whole bunch of like other storage stuff here ladders and look there's skylights in the ceiling y'all pretty high ceilings and stuff so bathroom over here Melissa. yeah so yeah this is the rest of the space and basically other artists rent out the different areas so there's artists down there and like it's basically like a huge warehouse -y type area and then my spot is right there so yeah bye studio i'll see you soon several days later man these past few days moving has been so so hectic i've technically been moved in here for a couple days now but i haven't even really had time to like put things together everything is still a mess i'm still doing random things like i have to mail this since i officially moved in i haven't had time to put my studio together yet i actually have a market coming up this sunday it's the black owned summer market in toronto so i've actually been prepping for that all week so i'm gonna be taking drake to the market show and i've got these canvas prints over here that i'll be taking but for now 
thanks for watching this moving vlog. Let me know if you're excited about the new studio. I definitely am. This is definitely an accomplishment for me so far in that artist's life. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like what I'm doing out here on the YouTube, you know, please subscribe for more art videos. And remember, don't be a waste man. Oh,